so policy 2019 examination paper part 2 section 2 physics we are going to explain so every day we explain at least to 5 bits for previous policy examination of physics and chemistry in this channel so first to in 2019 policy examination this is a question paper of section 2 physics part 61th question refractive index of glass with respect to air is 2 then critical angle at the inters interface we want to find so now you can see the solution 61th, 61 bit here critical angle is a given students critical angle a critical angle we want to find refractive index is given refractive index n is 2 and we want to find critical angle C so we know the relation between critical angle and refractive index is sin C is equals to 1 by n this implies C equal to sin inverse of 1 by n then C is equals to sin inverse of 1 by n n value is a given refractive index 2 so this is equal to 30 degrees so critical angle for this refractive index in the given medium is 30 degrees 30 degrees but how will be it is a 30 degrees we know from mathematics of trigonometry sin 30 degrees is equals to 1 by 2 then this implies 30 degrees equal to sin inverse of 1 by 2 so sin inverse of 1 by 2 equal to 30 degrees so this is uh, clarification for this so so for this answer is 30 degrees next which among the following materials has a higher refractive index higher refractive index is so you can see diamond diamond has higher refractive index it is a 2.42 diamond has a higher refractive index but you know refractive index is a higher means critical angle is a lower for critical angle of diamond also important for bits that is 24.4 degrees when a refractive index is higher critical angle will be lower so this critical angle value and this higher refractive index can carry total internal reflection inside the diamond so which makes it uh, shining more than any other material so next one 63 bit on which of the following factor does the focal length of the lens depend so focal lens of the lens depend only surrounding medium and another one also size of the lens size of the lens but size of the lens is not there but it is a surrounding medium next to 64th one a convex lens forms a convex lens forms virtual image when the object is placed between focus and optic center then size of the image compared to object so we can understand this one in the form of ray diagram so for 64th one it is a symbol for convex lens and this is the principal axis it is optic center focal point f1 center of curvature c1 focal point f2 center of curvature c2 here it is the object this is the object so it is one of the ray passing from the object another one is passing through passing through focal point then these two refracted rays are extending in the backward direction like that so they are intersecting at a point where you can see the position of image it is the image so this is the image image is always bigger than 
object size and it is a virtual image erect image and from here to here from here to here it is a image distance from here to here it is object distance but in this case image distance is greater than object distance size of image is uh, bigger than size of object so now you can answer the question so the size of the image compared to size of object options same size smaller or larger or none of these so it is a larger so in the next video again we can explain four more bits so daily the previous papers of polyset so we can explain so most useful for uh, getting a better rank in policy set 2022 if you follow this channel and subscribe it